Hey y'all, it's Kate from The Literary Apothecary and today is Wednesday so we're doing a book review and today we're going to review The People We Keep by Alison Larkin. This was a book of the month pick for July and I can't wait to talk about this because this was a very intriguing book to me. So a spoiler free summary of this book it takes place in mostly upstate New York in 1994. April Sawiki is our main character and she's down and out in life. She's living in a motor harm that her father won in a poker game. Her, she's failing out of school. She's got to pick up shifts as a waitress and so her mother has left her when she was really young. Her father only comes home when he's in arguments or fights with his girlfriend and one day after another fight with her father, April decides to leave home. She move as she moves through the world and builds her own family, found family. April chronicles her life in the songs that she writes. This lyrical, unflinching tale is for anyone who has ever yearned for the fierce power of found family, which you know is my favorite or to grasp the profound beauty of choosing to belong. For me, now let's get into some of the review part. For me, the beginning was a little slow, but the second half was absolutely fantastic. I felt like it was well written, solid characters, great emotional work. It just pulled on your heartstrings at every turn. So let's go into spoilers now. Some content warnings before you start this book. Abuse of all kinds. Um, child abuse, physical abuse, sexual abuse, alcohol abuse, drug abuse, all different kinds of abuse. Homelessness, a bit of swearing, and depression. If those are trigger warnings for you, be warned now that this has those in it. My favorite part was the very end of this book where all of her found family come together to help her out at her most desperate time and I love a found family and this found family is just so fantastic because she gathers members of her found family as she goes through life and travels throughout the country and then they all come together in one place at the end and it's just so heartwarming and so fantastic and I just love it so much. So some of my favorite quotes. Um, I wonder why we always thought kids who went to college were magically cool. Listening to Bob Dylan's voice swell through the lyrics is like drinking cool water when your mouth feels like it's stuffed with cotton. It seems strange to me that people choose to live with winter when they could see the sun in March. Um, and so, like I said, I really, really enjoyed this book. It wasn't the best book that I've read, but it was really, really great to read. Um, like I said, the beginning was a little bit slow, but then it picked up in that second half and made up for it dramatically. So I'll have a written review shortly on Goodreads for this book. And if you've read The People We Keep, let me know in the comments below what you thought of it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I have a new video out. As always, my Patreon and my Discord information will be in the description below. Come join the Patreon if you feel like supporting me even more. It's $1 a month and we have a ton of fun. Keep reading and I love you all to the moon and back. Bye.